Hey guys, this is Rich here at the Ultra Motorsports Warehouse, Fort Wayne, Indiana. Taking a look at this uh, 1964 Malibu Chevelle convertible. Okay, we're doing something we don't normally do around here, and that's bring this stuff out on an overcast day. This is a nice enough car, though. That you know what? I think it. Uh, I think it'll show perfectly even in this little gray weather we're having. Okay. Um, I want to walk around the outside of this car first. First, let me tell you a little bit about this car. This car was restored by a personal friend of the dealership. He did an amazing, amazing job. Okay, this is a 283, 195 horse car, um, and it's done excellently. It's done perfectly, perfectly, perfectly. Okay, we're going to take a look down these body lines. We're going to do something a little different that most, no, most car dealers don't do. Okay, and we're going to show you everything that's wrong with the car. And you know what? Uh, we're going to challenge you to find something wrong with the car yourself. Okay, take a look at these quarters. All right. No bubbles, no 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 runs, no drips, no pits. Everything's looking just the way it's supposed to look. Okay. Another high high area that, that uh, uh, problems tend to tend to find themselves. Nothing here. Okay. This is a great great car. I want to show you this chrome. You guys all take a look at that. I got one little scuff in this chrome. Other than that, the chrome on this vehicle is excellent. Okay. Everything's looking great on this car. All right. All the emblems, all the trim, everything's looking exactly like it's supposed to look. You guys can get a good look at this anytime you want. The last thing we want over here at Ultra Motorsports, okay, we don't want our our uh, our our customers to travel from any kind of distance whatsoever and then get here and there'll be some kind of surprise. Okay, we don't want any surprises later. All right, guys, if you look right here, I got one little etch here in this glass. I'd be happy to work out this with the, any potential buyer that we would have on this on this vehicle. Top. Excellent condition, okay? Brand new top on this car. Paint on this car looks amazing, all right? No stories. No stories with the chrome, nothing like that, okay? Back window looking great. Let's take a look at the inside of this car. I'll tell you what, we don't give 10s out here very often, okay? But this is a 9 out of 10, and the only reason it's not a 10 is because we don't give them out, okay? Take a look at this car, guys. <clears throat> look at the seats. See any stitching pulling anywhere? Anything? See any worn spots? Let's take a look at the, at the area that gets neglected a little bit. How about the back? How's that for a nice looking armrest? Huh? Nothing. No stories on this car. This car is slated to go to a collector car auction, but you know what, guys? I think you should try to get a hold of this thing before it does. Okay, if you want this for your personal vehicle, let's not let the auction grab 10% uh, when, when you're buying this car. Okay, there's no sense in that whatsoever. Plus your sales tax. Okay, you don't want that. Alright, guys, take a look at this dash. Excellent, excellent, excellent condition. We'll go dash a little bit more when we uh, when we uh, sit in the driver's seat. All right, top is looking great. All the pads look great for the convertible top. All right, door jams, excellent, excellent, excellent condition. Look at this, guys. What do you think? How's that for a nice looking armrest? Okay, how's that for a door panel? The weather stripping, brand new. All right. Anything you guys are trying to find on this thing that could be sloppy? How about this? Let's look at this at this uh, this part of the door here. How often you see that part of the door that's looking real sharp? Okay, no cracks, no stories. Just a real solid car. Real, real solid. No waves. Everything is is just the way it's supposed to be. <clears throat> look at the steering wheel, guys. No cracks in it. Everything works exactly like it's supposed to. Okay, let's fire this car up. Let's do this too. Let's take a look at this uh, at this correct 283 motor that's in this car. Guys, that's clean. All right, I don't care what anybody says. That's a clean looking car. Painted up nice, looking good, not overdone. Looks good. Okay. How about this too, guys? 81,194 miles that we believe to be actual. Just turn the lights on. How about the wipers? Fuel gauge works. How about the radio? Radio works. Cigarette lighter even works. Huh? Tell me this car is not drivable. All right? Let's get out so you guys can see these headlights. So you know they're working. That's important, right? You don't want to find out they're not working at night. You don't want to get all the way here and find out you got a couple hundred dollar repair bill to fix some headlights from some goofy electrical job, okay? Guys, this car, it's all there, okay? 
Oh yeah, you know what? I forgot the fun, the most fun part. Let's take this top down. Brand new motor on this top, okay? New motor, new pump, new lines, um, and uh, everything is working exactly like it's supposed to. I got the boot in the trunk for this car. You know what, let's just take a look at the trunk while we're out here. We might as well, huh? You know what I love about this car, guys? This, this is probably one of my favorite cars we've ever had here, okay? I've driven this car several times, all right? This car needs nothing, okay? There's the, there's the boot, guys, for the top, all right? We can take a look at that and get you some pictures of it if you really want some. Spattered trunk, just like it's supposed to be, all right? How's that for weather stripping on the trunk, huh? Tell me that isn't beautiful. If you're looking for spots where they where they skimped or did a chintzy paint job, if you're trying to find it, guys, you're not going to find it on this car. All right? It's solid. Okay? Everything is exactly how it's supposed to be. All right? Let's fire this up, guys, and we'll take it for our Ultra Motorsports test drive. Ready? Here we go. Power steering works great, guys. Don't be afraid to let your wife drive this car, all right? You know, this is a cruiser, okay? This is not a offensive muscle car that is, uh, you know, <clears throat> you're gonna roast down the street in, okay? This is a cruiser, guys. This is a car that you're gonna let your, uh, your, your son or daughter take to their high school prom. This is a car that you're gonna have in their wedding. This car looks that good, okay? This is a car that people are gonna look at, look at and say, I can't believe that guy is driving that thing outside. All right, and then when you tell them you got it for under twenty-five thousand, that's when the real shot comes. Okay, everything works like I said. That's what I love about this car. I've driven this car seventy mi seventy-five miles per hour down the highway, and it it drives great. Okay, no stories. Fuel gauge works. Headlights work. Bright lights work. Uh, windshield wipers work. Radio works. Cigarette lighter works. Horn works. All right. Just a really fun car. Really fun, really drivable. We're in Indiana, so you know what? If you're an IU fan, uh, this is, these are the colors for you, by the way. Okay, if you're an OSU fan, even better. Nebraska, yeah, same difference, okay? Guys, uh, this is a great car for tailgating, great car for parades, just because of the reliability. I mean, it's a, it's a, it's a great, great car. What I'd like to do is, I'd like to encourage anybody to come take this car for a test drive if you have any interest in it at all, okay? Once you drive it, I know you'll love it, okay? Uh, feel free to contact me through our website, ultramotors.net, okay? My name is Rich. Reach out to me. I would love to pick you up at our airport, Fort Wayne International Airport. Um, I'll pick you up, come over, look at our collection. You can drive this beautiful vehicle or any one of our other vehicles that we have there at our facility. and. Um, and we can uh, we can get get a relationship built, okay? You can also feel free to call me on my cell phone. Yeah, that's right. I'm giving my cell phone out on YouTube. My number is 260-704-0234. My name is Rich. Okay, call me anytime. Anytime you want to talk cars. Uh, if you got a car and you want to and you want an honest appraisal, we're here to build relationships. So you know what? Let us do that with you. Okay? Turn signals on. Work. Everything works on this car. Beautiful car. Uh, Everywhere you think they would they would skimp on this car, they didn't. Okay, guys, all this all this trim pieces are looking beautiful. All this paint job on the inside, beautiful. Okay. Like I said, check us out online at ultramotors.net. If you guys have any interest in this car, I encourage you to reach out to me on the website. My name is Rich, and uh, we'll see if we can't uh, make a deal. All right, thanks a lot, guys.